after 70 years, India gets a cheetahs again. For centuries, hunting was a favoured activity for royalty in India. The cheetah, which was relatively easy to take and less dangerous than tigers, was frequently used by Indian nobility for sport hunting. The earliest available record for cheetahs being used for hunts in India comes from the 12th century Sanskrit text Manasolasa, which was produced by the Kalyani Chalukya ruler Someshwara. The cheetahs were then trained so that they could participate in royal hunts. The process took three to four months. Jahangir took after his father and is said to have caught more than 400 antelopes by cheetah course in the Paragana of Palu, the site that is near New Delhi's international airport today. The demand for cheetahs for hunting purposes was so high that specific areas which had high population were designated for their capture. Rajasthan's Jodhpur, Punjab's Bhatinda and Haryana's Hisar. Under the British Raj, forests were extensively cleared so as to develop settlements and to set up indigo, tea and coffee plantations. This further resulted in the loss of habitat for big cats, contributing to their decline. While tigers were the choice animals for the British shikar, Indian and British sport hunters also targeted cheetahs. The administrative policy of the British Raj played a major role in extermination of cheetah in India. The rewards for bounty hunting likely caused a decline of cheetahs. As a result, wild cheetah became very rare in India by the 20th century. Cheetah is the only large carnivore to have gone extinct in India, primarily due to hunting and habitat loss. Maharaja Ramanuj Pratap Singh of Madhya Pradesh is widely believed to have killed the last three recorded cheetahs in India. In 1952, the Indian government officially declared the cheetah extinct in the country. In 2007, the Indian government set up a new laboratory for conservation of endangered species on the outskirts of Hyderabad. The laboratory had a mandate of resurrecting extinct animals including cheetahs. In 2009, the Ministry of Environment and Forest and the Wildlife Trust of India conducted a meeting to discuss the feasibility of cheetah reintroduction. Several sites were chosen, of which Kuno Palapur National Park was seen as the most suitable. The African cheetahs have now been introduced in a carefully chosen location on an experimental basis.